A chub frenzy has begun in the mountains. Well, I don't know what that's all about yet. Well, hi, everybody. Welcome back. Great to have you. What's going on? What do we got? Ooh, the fair. All right. Well, weather report today. Clear and sunny for the fair, of course. A fortune teller today. Good humor. Very nice. A land. Tappers. Slap those tappers on trees. Maple trees. Maple syrup. Oh, trees. Resin. Pine trees. Pine tar. Syrup is the most valuable of all tree products. Okay. All right. Let's switch out back to our normal... Our normal uh, apparel here, shall we? Uh, back to the normal shirt. Yes. Okay. And back to the normal hat as well. Nice. Let's grab this. And let's switch it out for that, just because. Go on over here. We're going to put this away. We're going to put the hat on the cat. Where is the cat? Oh, Tiger, where have you gone? The Stardew Valley Fair is tomorrow. Don't forget to bring your items for the display. Yeah, about that. Um, nine, you say? Hmm. Well. Oops. We'll see how that goes. Uh, kitty cat, come here. You need a hat. Oh, that is adorable. <laughs> oh, man. Oh, cats and hats and hats and cats are amazing. That's all I have to say. Alright, now, which one of the goats has milk today? That would be Billy the Kid. Thank you so much, Billy the Kid, for the, for the milk. I appreciate the kind donation. Now, we do have this extra cheese press, which I don't... I can't see where we're putting it. There we are. So that's fun. Put all that away. And now it's time for the chickens and ducks and things. No dino yet, I don't think. Don't think we have a dino yet. Let's refill the watering can. Pop on in here and see what has been left to us. Lots of eggs, as one would expect in the coop. Yes, indeed. We don't have enough money to upgrade this further, currently. Nor do we have the money to upgrade the barn. Now that is, of course... Oh, look how adorable. That is the cutest thing. I love it. I'm going to leave that hat on the cat for quite a while, I think. I thought I had my fishing rod. Do I? Do I not? Guess not. Okay. Uh, right. We still don't have the fiberglass fishing rod. Okay. Uh, do we want diamonds to be cloned for now? I would go with jade, but I don't actually have one. So that makes that harder. Um, just slap this here for now. How are we doing on food? We could probably cut down some things. We have more pumpkins that we could plant, I think. 13 days. Yes, we can plant them today, and then then that's it. Alright, let's plant a couple there. We're gonna leave those there. Uh, we do need more tree tappers. Also, what is, what is down here in my way constantly? Do I have my axe? I don't. We're gonna have to get the axe out and take care of this nonsense. But we do need more tree taps. Maybe we go and take care of that? Not sure. Do I have my side? Oh, I do have my axe with me. It's just way over there. Well, we'll have to check that in a moment. Maybe we just leave that pumpkin there. Uh, maybe we save the rest of these seeds and put them... I have, an, I have a thought. I'm having a thought. I'm having a thought. We're going to need uh, some sprinklers, though. So maybe that doesn't happen until... Winter? Okay, so there's a couple things. Uh, winter time, we can get any seed, uh, any flower mixed seed. We can get any flowers. So we're going to try and get some poppies from that. Um... I'm not sure how that's going to go, but that's what we're going to try. Okay, so at that time, we will do that. In addition to that, 
uh, in the winter time is when we'll go into Lewis's basement. Yes, I know about it. Yes, we'll do it. But we're going to wait till winter. Now, you may be wondering, Hilhun, why are you going to wait until winter? And I answer you. Because, darn it, I need something to do in winter. Okay? Like, listen. Sometimes you got to spread out the content a little bit so you have stuff you can do in other seasons. You know what I'm saying? Like, just gotta, just gotta be patient a little bit with me, okay? Some things I do, it's not because I don't know about or haven't thought about or or whatever. It's because um, I'm I'm really I'm really waiting for for something specific, you know. And um, that would be the case with that, okay? Uh, we will get there eventually. It will it be as soon as some of you want? Maybe not, but we'll we'll get it done. We'll get it done. All right, we can put this down there. Uh, all three of our those need something. All right, if I was gonna put something in those, well, you know what? Let's try some. Let's try some pumpkin juice, I guess. Let's eat this. Okay. Uh, we can sell a couple more things. Do I need you for the community center? No. So I could make another beehive. Good to know. And I have some... Some fertilizer. Okay. We do have some saplings. Now, as we may remember, or at least I hope you all remember, we did get the greenhouse done. Look at this. It's lovely. Uh, so we're just gonna plop down a couple uh, fruit trees in here for now, but we're gonna need to put some sprinklers in there so that we can grow our ancient seeds. A chub frenzy has begun in the mountains. Well, I don't know what that's all about yet, because I have not done it, but I did see that that was something that was new in this last update. Was it the fishing and mining update? Is that what it was called? Something like that. Okay, that's good. And we walk through here. Nope. Can't walk. Oh, there we go. That's clear. How about you? That's clear. Okay, we need vinegar. Yeah. We're gonna need some vinegar. Got a lot of these uh, mossy seeds floating around of late. Definitely a good thing. Okay, a couple of you are done. Very good. Now, do, let's look at our resources here for just a minute. We do have enough that we can certainly get some things created here. Right then, let's look. What seeds do we have? Um, None in there. What about here? Uh, we could do some strawberries. Could. What else do we have? Um, broccoli regrows. Okay, let's do... We can do pumpkins. Ancient seeds for sure. Uh, sure, we'll do some pumpkins. Okay. What else might we be desiring of? Turning carrots into seeds might not be a bad idea. Uh, we could we could just constantly grow some hops or some blueberries. Uh, we do have a lot of hops right now. I don't, I don't know that we need to do that. Some summer squash might not be bad, though, because that's pretty, pretty good energy, and we seem to still need a lot of that pretty regularly. So is that what we do? Do we just... Ooh, you know... Let's do this. We'll just make some more seeds real quick. That'll work. Uh, also, I, I've never tested this. Oh, you really can fill it up. That's so cool. Thank you so much for that tip, friends. I would never have tried that without your encouragement. It's just not something I would have thought of. All right, so let's let's just kind of get this laid out a little. 
to cover like the most land area possible for now. And then we'll just uh we'll just take care of it. Very nice. Now that we're done in here, what do we do with the rest of our day? I think I'm going to go plot out what the heck we're going to bring over to the Grange. Because, like, I really don't... I really don't know. I don't really have a good idea. What do we take? Hmm. These are questions I have no answers to. I am glad we were able to make this many more sprinklers, though. All right, we're going to start the ancient seeds down here. Like so. Um, yeah, I think we're, for now we're going to put, we're going to put eight squash down just to get some energy going. We'll plant our pumpkins up here because they will be done well before the time that our ancient seeds really do anything. It will take some time for them to, to grow. I wouldn't mind having maybe some, I don't know, maybe some cranberries or... I don't know, something. Something like that in here. There we are. Now this is the only time that we ever have to water any of this because sprinklers are amazing. How many more do we need of this kind? Uh, Six more plus another four, so we need like ten. That's kind of a lot, but okay. Alright, let's, uh, let's remove a couple trees from over here. There we are. And um, I think this one. Now we can move the greenhouse. Let's not forget that. Uh, so my original thought was that we should put the house right here. Move our house to over here and then we'll put the greenhouse over like where the house is maybe. Or like maybe take out this fence and put the greenhouse like like right here and then move the coop somewhere else I don't know I, I, f I feel like a giant farm redesign at some point is going to happen and I'm just not quite sure when I'm going to get around to that but maybe in the winter time because it'll just be easier then okay so that's done I could make another couple of kegs um do I want to? I don't know that I do right at this moment in time. I would like some more energy though, and while I'm thinking of that, let's uh, let's make some carrot seeds. Now then, do I have anything that's like that's pretty good energy? There we go. What am I gonna do with the energy? That that's a good question. Um, we'll go chop down some trees maybe. Once this is done, we got mixed seeds. How very kind of you, game. And that's summertime. Very nice. Okay. What does that give me? 12? Yeah, that's not bad. Right then. Let's let's just go and... I'm just gonna kind of make some more hay for a little bit here. Gotta love it. Get the hay by it. We should check in on the on the cave too, I suppose, and just see if there's anything exciting there. I mean I doubt it, but maybe we'll get another apple and I can I'll just laugh about it, because that'd be pretty fun. So much moss over here. 90 hay. That puts us at about 270, and um, we can certainly use more than that. Nice. All right, what do we got? Uh, not much. Not much at all. All right. Oh, well, gold quality, though. I don't think that we need that. 
A little smack here. Get a little hay. Grab a little moss. Get down tonight. Bow wow wow. Get down tonight. Speaking of tonight, what are your plans today, friends? What have you been up to? You do anything exciting today? Was today an exciting day or just a mundane like work day, school day? Like what were you up to? I went to work. That's what I did. And um what else did I do today? I uh I joyously uh am going to get some barbecue tonight for dinner. That's gonna be that's gonna be pretty great. Thank you, crops, for not bouncing out of bounds. Now, do we plant more amaranth? Do we have more amaranth to plant? Mm, that's a question. Maybe we should maybe we should look at that a little more closely. I say as I continue to get hay. The silo's gotta be close to being full. I'm like, I don't know how close, but it's gotta be close. It's gotta be pretty close. My goodness. Hmm. Okay, well, we have we have one one normal one we can put it there. <laughs> Do we have any more? Okay, we've got a few here. It's not a lot. We might have to we might have to use a couple uh, silver ones here. There we go. Let's let's do three. There we go. That's three more. It's eight. Uh, plus like hopefully another what? Uh several. Five, that's thirteen. Uh seven plus two. Yeah, well it's gonna be close. I feel like I planted more than thirteen though, but No, only 10. Okay. Well, they are replanted. Let's 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 do this. We can sell the rest. I don't think I need them for anything. And I'm pretty sure, yep, already gave Marnie hers. Put a couple in here though. I don't I don't know. Do you need them for any recipes? I'm I'm actually not sure. Hmm. So that's a good it's a good question. That's spring. Where's summer? There's summer. Right, we'll sell these. Doop, 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 doop. Nice. Now we could make we could make some more. Uh well like of everything really. Hmm. Alright. Sure, I guess we'll we'll do that. That'll give us a lot of refined quartz. Grange Festival. What do we take? Uh, we can take this diamond. We can take a battery. Okay, let's let's grab let's grab the items while we're thinking of them. We can put this hat back in the house. You know, squid ink. Is that really gonna help us? I don't. I don't feel like it is, but maybe. I've got a gold pumpkin. All right, that's pretty nice. Uh, we've got a silver apricot. Okay. Maybe this strange doll. Um. Yeah, we do have the syrups and stuff. I don't. I don't know that that's what I want in life. All right, one, two, three, four, five. We have six items. We need. <laughs> we need three more things. Oh gosh. Uh what else could we even put in there? I don't even have any food that I could like slap in there, you know what I'm saying? Uh Gosh, that's that's really unfortunate. <laughs> A strawberry? Man, if I had an ancient fruit, that would be something. Uh purple tea thing? A wine? Okay. All right. I mean, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Okay. I mean, that's nine items. I'm not real confident about it. Um, but maybe it'll be good enough. I don't. <laughs> I'm not feeling it. I'm really not feeling it. We'll find out. We'll find out together, friends.
Now, I will say, we didn't sell that much stuff, but we got a decent amount of money there. And I will also say, this half income has not been nearly as bad as I, I thought it'd be, like, super hard. And, like, I'm not saying it's not occasionally frustrating with how much you don't make, but... It's really not, it has not been as, uh, nearly as bad as I thought it might be. Alright, 315, 38. So, like, the, would the gold bar be better than the star drop T then? Is it just based on monetary value, or is it... I don't know. I've never understood the, the Grange uh, metrics. You know what I'm saying? Uh, yeah. Okay, let's 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 put the put that there, I guess. We'll bring the gold bar instead. Well, maybe we'll get a cheese and a mayo and stuff too. That would give us some more options, certainly. That is true. That is true. And if I look over here, don't, don't we have one of the legendary fishes, don't we? Yeah, we got a legendary fish. I mean, okay, so all right, we could use another fish pond. Uh, goats, please, come outside. Other cow is inside. Mushell doing, doing your job over there. Let's see, we do have a cheese. We got a couple cheeses. Okay, okay, things are kind of looking up, I guess. Uh, do we have a... If we, could have like, if we had like an iridium duck feather, maybe I would... I, see, I just don't know. I don't know what the score is based on. And honestly, I've never looked it up. Like, I've never been like, you know, I'm so curious about this. I'm going to look up how to get the highest possible score. I've, I've never... I, I, yeah, I've never cared enough to do that. I'm just going to assume right now that it's based on, like, monetary value and go from there, I guess. Okay, well, we certainly have plenty of options of things to put into the festival. All right, that's, sometimes it's the best you can hope for, really. Now, if we would have had a fairy rose honey, I would have been all about that. Really would have. Double check through here. Look for any more. Any more of anything, honestly. And probably what I should do is make... We need to we need to pave this over is what we need to do. But I don't know. I mean I guess I would have the resources for that. I would I would maybe want to do brick though, and uh, we do not have enough clay for that. Not at all. We do have all three open, yes, okay. The Stardew Valley, Valley Fair has begun. Perfect. Lovely. Tra okay, so we, we can get the fedora. We want the rare crow. The star drop. Ooh, we can get a prize ticket. Okay. Oof. All right. We can get a lot of good stuff in here. Well, let's start at the top and work our way down, shall we? Let's see what's going on up here. Man, I can't take another bite of this barbecue sandwich. I'm stuffed. Trying to get Gus to tell me his sauce recipe. He won't budge. Oh, yeah. That was delicious. Mmm, this barbecue sauce is amazing. All right, I was going to say something, but it'd be creepy and weird. I'm not going to say it. <laughs> Smoked turkey haunch. I guess the festival's not all bad. I wish Gus would include a vegetarian option. Zucchini skewer, maybe? Eat as much as you like. It's all free today. Compliments of Mayor Lewis, otherwise known as your tax money. That's right. Are you strong? Uh, I try not to be. Pierre's very serious about his Grange display. He's setting aside the best looking stuff for weeks. Oh, you mean the stuff I sold to it? My store carries the finest quality products in the whole valley. Please inspect my Grange display closely. See what you can see. All right. 
So we're going to put that in the middle, and we're going to put you over there, and we're going to slap this there. Uh, put this here. I guess we'll put the bottle of wine out. Ancient doll, a cheese, I think. Man, I wish I had a gold star uh, cheese, but I sure don't. Um, and then maybe the 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 duck mayonnaise. Sure. All right, we're gonna go with that. We'll see what happens. Try my best. My display's weak compared to Pierre's. You have an amazing cheese wheel, though, so therefore you win in my heart. Set up a range display is your chance. Yes, indeed. I show off all my stuff over there. What's the biggest cheese wheel I've ever seen? Impressive. Oh, you can't get the garbage today? Bummer. Oh, a hen pick, pecked my little finger. Moo. Excuse me, please. Just a few steps over there. Gus has grown up a batch of pork ribs. Yikes. Hilarious. Oh, lovely animals are friendly and love to get massaged. All right. Does that does that make the beef softer? Or animals never judge people by their looks. The same cannot be said for humans. Well, that's true, Linus. That is true. Nothing on the board that we can check today because we're here. Well, what can I have done to her for a long time? She is a remarkable diviner. Wow, wow. Well, that's blocked off as well. He doesn't look very happy. I guess Mary Lewis had to cut costs this year. Can't talk to the clown. You know, I would have made a pretty good clown. I think I missed my calling. I, you might have. What a working's an ancient tradition. Okay. I really admire Robin's carpentry skills. I use a lot of the same techniques in my line of work. Quince blades get sharper every year. Robin really works hard on her carpentry stuff. She deserves the recognition. Well, I appreciate it when she builds things on my farm. I complain about my job, but I do take pride in my work. Some of the finest pieces I have. Okay. Kind of hectic today. I'm just going to hang out here for a while. Hey, having a good time? I am. Slingshot tent's pretty fun. If you get good at it, you can really rack up the tokens. I go for fishing, usually. Won the Wheel of Chance ten in a row. Now the man won't let me play anymore. Pick a color. Uh, I don't I don't have anything to play here. That's a fine looking town. Nice and cozy. All right. I already beat all the games. Now what? Played the strength game too many times. My arms are rubber. Rough. Been to the fortune teller? Hmm. I've not. Better hurry, kid, before Pam finishes all the stuff. Fifty. Fifty? Oh, normally I don't worry about that, but like... Bang. I am low on the old monies comparatively to normal. Just saying. A tuna. Wow, 57, really? Wow. Okay. It's a pretty big score for just a tuna. Are there different fish in here now? Oh, I didn't get my perfect. Catfish? What is going on? They changed all the fish in here, I guess. Does that mean that we can get points even faster? Is that what that means? If we do well? Maybe. Is it based on fish you've caught, like, out in the world now or something? That would be interesting. Well, I guess we'll see what we get at the end here, huh? So I think like 208 is about what I usually end up with. Well, we will see what happens here. Two fifty-two. Crazy. Oh, just barely. 313. Not bad. Fish caught. Perfection bonus. 
686. Reward 828. Pretty solid. Alright, yeah, let's do that again. Let's see what else we can get in here. Then we'll go spend some points. And then we'll go to the Grange and see how that turns out for us. Which maybe it turns out great, maybe it doesn't. 59 per catfish, huh? Okay. Still only one point for the algae. That means we're doing amazing. You can get 100 hay for 500 points. So I suppose then that you could actually get a monetary value of points, right? Because you could just look at, okay, here's how much hay, here's how much hay you get, here's how many points it costs, here's how much it costs the hay, and do some quick math there and you could figure that out. I don't think I'm inclined to do that math, but you could if you wanted to. 140. So we're at about half of what we were last time. Currently. We got some time left, although not a lot. Ba Boom! What did we get last time? 313, wasn't it? Yeah, I don't... I don't know that we're going to get that this time. Maybe the perfection bonus will make up for some of it. I guess we'll see. Also, yay, tuna fish. Let's go. Two sixty-six. All right, so we're about fifty points less, but we got more perfect catches. So pretty close. We came pretty close to the same amount. All right, not bad. Uh, we're, yeah, we're gonna do one more. We're gonna do one more, and then that should be enough for the star drop, I do believe. Which will enable us to uh, go get that. And then we'll use the whatever we get from the Grange for some other stuff and see where that leaves us. Because we want the rare crow, don't forget. Give me that rare crow. To get the other one at the flower dance in the springtime. The one that I always forget to get. Maybe by then we will have an interest of love. Love, 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 la 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 love, interest of love. That's right. Sometimes you've got a love interest. I'm thinking Maru. I'm thinking Maru for this playthrough. I've never uh, married Maru. I don't know what her 10 heart or uh, 14 heart events are. So that would be fun. I had a lot of fun uh, making uh, Kravis the, our, our roommate uh, in the last playthrough in the mixing challenge. That was pretty cool. Uh, never done that before, so that was neat. And who was the other other one I haven't married? I think is uh, I believe most of you would say Leah. I would say Leah because when I was younger, I knew somebody with that name, and that's how they pronounced it. Uh, so that's why I say it that way. I've been informed in the comment section for years that that is not the normal way to say it, but you know what? Sometimes you just say it how you learned it. Know what I'm saying? Hope you know what I'm saying. Oh good, that fish so counted even though we were at zero time. 328? Is that a new record? A new record. I don't think it matters <laughs> too much, really. 888, amazing. We got so many star tokens. I wonder what the maximum star tokens you can hold is. Is it 2,500, 5,000? I, I really don't know. Yes, I would like to trade them in. I would like this delicious star drop, thank you. Oh, give me the power. Yes, the power. You found a star drop. The taste reminds you of cheese curds. Your maximum energy level has increased. Excellent. It's the big day, our most important festival of the year, the Stardew Valley Fair. If you'd like to participate and set up a display, I left an empty stand for you. Let me know. Uh, I am ready for your judging. Why don't you uh, get over there and judge me? 
Mr. Judger. And this thing I can never remember if it's green or orange that is the more winning side. So that's why I never use that. I just go fishing because I can never remember <laughs> during the event. And then I look it up and I'm like, oh, it was that one. And then I just, my, it does not, that information does not stay in my brain. I've tried to remember it for like several years now and it just, it died. I don't know. I got a mental block. Just saying. All right, Lewis, what do we got? Hey, not bad. You won second with a rating of 82. 500 tokens. Well, that gives me enough to uh, get what I want to get out of the uh, lovely and amazing turn in your tokens place. So, usually I have like a prismatic shard and a better bottle of wine. That is not a great bottle of wine. <laughs> <laughs> we usually have some other stuff, is what I'm trying to say. This playthrough's been a little slow. Okay, rare... Oh, the prize ticket. Yes. We also need the prize ticket. So we need a thousand? Okay, we gotta go fishing a little bit more. I want that ticket. Give to me your ticket, game. Oh, 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 this is the... Oh, I'm so bad at this. Nope. I am using the mouse and keyboard at the moment for this instead of, uh... It's still so hard to aim, like, I'm not used to it. Man, it's so bad. How long does this go for? Oh, I got more than one there, at least. <laughs> Missed. It stopped moving. Score 52. Accuracy 75%. Okay, 60 tokens. Not bad. That's fun. What's this? B buy them? Oh. Yeah, no, that's... I'm way too cheap for that. Why would you do that when you could just pay 50 and come here and fish and get, like, 800? But like, you pay 50 for one? Or you can pay 50 for, like, 800? Like, what would you... What would you pick, friends? My goodness. Is that stand run by Joja? Is that... Is that the secret there? Is secretly Joja is infiltrating the Stardew Valley Fair and like <laughs> try to take it over, or is it uh, from uh, from uh, was that a Reseteer or Reketeer, however you want to pronounce it? So, capitalism, ho! <laughs> uh, what a fun game that is! I really need to do a playthrough of that game on the channel. It really is a fun game. There's a lot of hidden characters and stuff, too, that you can get, and... I don't know. I just really enjoy that game. And if you... If you if you fail to pay off your debt... You end up in a cardboard box. And, like... It's sad, but also funny at the same time. Like, I feel bad about it. Wow, hello, what are you? You seem very excited. Are you a catfish? My goodness. That was a catfish indeed. 243. Okay, well, with another catfish, we might make 300. What do I need? I need a thousand. I think we're going to have to do this twice to get that many points. Just saying. Even with the perfection bonus. Yeah, we, I don't think we're going to get 800 out of that. Let's call it a hunch. Oh, we just barely made it. Look at that. Because we need a thousand for the ticket. Okay. Now, is there anything else that we have a burning desire for as a reward over here? Well, let's just take a little look-see. Uh, I mean, I wouldn't 
wouldn't mind having the dried sunflowers. Maybe we just try to do it here. Is it the green one? I don't know. <laughs> uh, let's go green, I guess. And uh, how about 14? We'll see what happens. Is it orange that it ends up on most of the time? I don't know. I used the whole five tokens for this. It's amazing. Bruh. I wonder if I wonder if the math changed here. Alright, let's uh let's go orange again with our last five. Watch it be actually green and I was right the first time. Hey, look, I won. We're, we're, we're going to be big. We're going to be big spenders here. That's what we're doing. Five at a time. That's right. Dublin or nothing. It, it seems 50-50 at this point. So far in our experience, it's been 50-50. And really, that's all that matters. Click, 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 click. That's going to be green again. I wonder if it really is green. I don't know. It was like... It was three to two. It's impossible to say. What do we need? A hundred only? Well, I'm not paying that outrageous fee. We'll just go fishing again. Hilarious. Imagine if that really was truly 50-50. I know it was 75-25, and like I said, I just, I can't ever remember. And honestly, I don't want to look it up, because, you know, it's more fun sometimes to not have a perfect run than it is to have something perfect, in my opinion. I'm not one of those people who would ever have something perfect anyway, so. I just, I guess I don't worry about it. I will never be a speedrunner <laughs> in any game. Not in any game at all. I will say I was excited to see some Hades 2 gameplay the other day. Uh, I really enjoyed the first game gameplay a lot. And uh, I 100% that game on my 100th attempt. I, I, I beat 44 of those 100 attempts. And I, I was almost 48. So I felt pretty, pretty excited. I actually made it... I think was it my first? No, I think it was my second attempt. I made it all the way to Hades in that game and uh anyway it was it was a good time really enjoyed the mechanics of the game and sort of how the, the gameplay loop was and yeah that was fun that was a fun one i liked it liked it a lot looking forward to playing through some front mission 2 as soon as that comes out on steam and that should be like this next this next weekend actually so that's fun. I don't know if I'll, if I'll get to it this next weekend. I'm trying to finish up Banisher's Ghosts of New Eden still in the live stream. Which is going okay. Uh, it's a fun game. I enjoy the gameplay. But um, it, it's kind of dragging along at this point. And uh, I was hoping to be done. But part of that's my own fault for just being busy and not having as much time to play as I want. 732 tokens. Oh my goodness. What are we going to do with that many tokens? I just don't know. Imagine if you could turn in tokens for money. What an exploit that would be. All right. Sunflowers, Fedora, beautiful. We're out of here. Thank you, everybody, for a great Stardew Valley Fair. We'll see you all again next year, maybe, and uh, I'll try to win the Grange. That's the hope and the dream. The dream and the hope. Right. Time to put things away. Uh, the fish goes in here. The various and assorted mining-related things go in here. Those get quick stacked. I don't know what else we can quick stack. We're just going to go through and quick stack a bunch of things and just see what disappears out of the inventory. Not as much as I was hoping, uh, if we're going to be honest. All right. Squidding. Now, what do I... I don't need this bottle of wine for anything, right? We can sell that. I'm going to hold on to that ancient doll still. Okay. Let's sell some things. 
You can sell a ticket? Why would you... Why? Why would you do that? Okay, there's number three. We have three. We're putting them there so that we know how many we have. Let's switch that out. Wait, does, was that actually putting off light? No, not, not really. The cat's like, are you going to bed? Like, oh, well, maybe. Just look through my inventory some more. Okay. Go refill. Wait, do we? I did water. I did water the pumpkins, right? Down here? Oh my gosh, we did not. I'm glad that I checked. That would have been tragic. All right. Let's try to remember to do this every day. That's the problem. Once I get sprinklers, I just assume that everything has a sprinkler, and then I don't. I don't think to double check. We're going to leave our friend the pumpkin up top there. Uh, in the hopes that once everything else grows, maybe we can get a giant pumpkin again. That's the hope. We'll see. I'm not sure if it'll work, but that's why we're leaving it. Because I don't really want to have to grow another one. So There you go. You know the other thing that we should maybe think about growing in the greenhouse? Do I have some? I bet I do in the spring chest here. Hang on, let me just... Let me just run over here. Do I... I do. All right. Let's go and take this over. And get some coffee going. You guys know me and coffee, you know? Uh... We're gonna need that, so let's let's definitely plant those. Well, that makes me feel better. Delicious coffee coming our way. I think we can put a couple things back in here. Yeah, what are we gonna do in the next couple days? Well, we have to go take this over to Lewis's house, that's for sure. A prize ticket. Let's see what's coming up. What do we got? Marnie's birthday is coming. The bookseller. We don't really have a lot of money. Uh, we need enough to upgrade the barn. I'm not sure how we're going to get that. But now that the greenhouse is functioning, life gets a little bit better. A little bit better for sure. Excellent. Okay. Well, that's going to do it for the episode, I think. Uh, let's just double check the weather tomorrow. Is it sunny, right? Yeah, okay. Let's look through the community center and just see what else we still need. We need winter forage, okay? I need a sandfish, we have to go to the desert for that. I need a poppy, we can take care of that in the winter, and a truffle, we're hoping that there's one at the traveling cart. I need one more apple, which we will get, and I need a Spirit Eve jack-o'-lantern. That's not too hard, and that's it. That's all we need. Those. That's it, everything else is done, okay. Well, it's certainly possible that we'll get that taken care of here in year one. Wouldn't that be fascinating and amazing? I don't think I've ever done that. I don't think I've ever finished a community center in in year one. I've gotten to it very early in year two because of the pigs. <laughs> but I don't think I've ever done it in just like year one. Huh. Something to think about. All right. Well, hey, thanks for hanging out. Appreciate y'all being here. Thank you so much for enjoying the videos, and we will catch you in the next one. Have a great one. Bye-bye.